What is up, yo? Reno here, and I am excited to say that yours truly and my partner, Rude, happen to have procured the day off and what plans we have. We're gonna go to the city, we're gonna get into all kinds of trouble, we might even try... Oh, hang on. Hey there, partner. Yeah, I was just thinking about that, so I thought we could... Oh. Elena's got the day off too, huh? Well, how lucky for her. She what? Tea party? Who the heck has a tea party anymore? Wait. Oh, Rudio, I don't... Okay, 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 okay. You have a point. We will never hear the end of this if we do not go along. Alright. If you're in, then I guess I'm in. How soon can you be here? Alright. Okay. I'll be ready. See you then. Well, looks like the Turks Day Off has now turned into the Turks Tea Party. I don't even know if I like tea. Well, here we go. Stand by one. Right, so here we are in the Turk Mobile. We've got my partner in crime, Root, over here, and we've got Ms. Tea Party herself, Elena, back there. Yeah, the, um, the boss is a little bit weary about taking company vehicles while we're on our day off, so we couldn't exactly use the helicopter today, but uh, even though it is a beautiful day for flying, eh, we'll just use the road, like everybody else. It'll be fine. It'll just take us a little while longer to get there. See you when we have food. All right, not gonna lie. When I think of tea parties, I think pink frilly dresses and quaint little teacups and gossip about the, the latest boy toys in the area, but this is pretty nice. Elena, I'm not gonna lie. I think you might have had a good idea. Hey, it's nice out. Why not? What have you to say about it, Rude? It's okay. <laughs> a man of few words, always. All right, let's try some of this stuff, shall we? Got a giant chicken Waldorf salad thing here. Goodness, how am I supposed to get my mouth around this? Good gravy. Hmm. That's pretty okay. I dig it. But I have one question. All this tea, where's the crumpets? You have a scone. She's right, I do have a scone. But let's find out if I like tea. I don't use, I'm a coffee guy myself. I got something called the Naughty Vicar, so <laughs> go figure, somebody giving me tea that says I'm naughty, how about that? But that's okay, Rude got the same thing. Tastes like one of those mocha choco frappe things that you get at that uh, one coffee place. Only without the coffee. Wrap your brain around that one. Okay, I can rock with that, I guess. It's strong. It's just like I like my coffee. All right. I got a lot to tackle here. I'm gonna be fat by the end of this. How's your guys'? Good. It's okay. It's okay. Rude is never impressed by anything. But this, 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 this is really, look, look at all this. Sandwiches and, oh, I forgot to show you the best part. Look at what we got in here. Bum, 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 bum. We have a nice little chocolate cup dessert here. Some macarons, a little swan thing. I have no idea what the heck that thing is here, but it looks delicious and I cannot wait to destroy it. And we've also got this little cake down here, so yeah. Beautiful day, nice company, good food. I'll be the first to admit, maybe I was wrong. This is a good way to spend a day off. All right, am I the only one getting like mad Willy Wonka vibes from this here? You know that scene where he's like eating, drinking for the butter from the butter cup, and he's just like, and singing, and then he just takes the cup and goes, and bites into it? 
That's exactly how I feel right now. I need a giant top hat, big purple jacket. Come with me and you'll be in a land of copyright infringement. Please don't strike me, YouTube. That was a parody. Come on. Right, I have got to figure out what this beautiful swan thing is because, I mean, it's it's art. Let's let's face it, guys. It's art. <laughs> it, it, is, it is art. And, ah, uh, as hungry as I am, as much as I like sweets, I kind of don't want to eat it. I want to, like, frame it. So, here we go. I want to, but I don't. It's killing me. Three, two, one. Um, <laughs> all right, so... I've discovered the best way to do it, decapitate the doggone thing. I'm gonna grab the neck, tear it off here. All right, that was a swan neck at one time. Here we go. Whoa! I didn't see that coming. It's like, it's porous, but when you dip it in the cream, it's spongy. Whoa! That really threw me off. Shouldn't tell them now the sponges are porous. Mm. That's enough out of you, Elena. She thinks I'm stupid. Joke's on her. I really am. <laughs> ha! I bet he doesn't even know how to spell porous. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna put you on the spot. How do you spell porous, Elena? P O R O U S. Porous. Bookworm. <laughs> what do you think about this, Rude? Okay. <laughs> I'm trying not to corpse here, but I can't help it. I think I swear the man only knows the one word. It's okay. Two words. <laughs> I can count. Be quiet. <laughs> he said something else. <laughs> All right, out with it. What else do you know? It's okay. Here we go again. <laughs> My partner, ladies and gentlemen. You gotta love him. I just totally had a eureka moment. I know what the swan is now. Yeah. It is, oh, oh no. Devonshire cream down. Oh no, it's gone everywhere. Talk about lactose intolerance. Mmm, <laughs> there it is, the zinger. Thank you, Rude. No. Wait, he actually has more vocabulary? Barely so. It's a deconstructed and then reconstructed cream puff. The inside is like a vanilla buttercream type deal and that's why it's so flaky and porous on the outside because it's a cream puff. Brilliant, why didn't I think of that? I'm gonna need like a dozen of those to go like right now, come on. I mean, the world's gotta know about how good that is. There, 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 there was teeth involved. There was teeth involved. There was teeth, wow. <laughs> Sounds pretty painful. <laughs> so yeah, we're all out here. Having ourselves a little walk. It's a beautiful day. The park is absolutely lovely. Not too crowded. People are kind of keeping their distance. Maybe because they see three Turks walking down the road. I don't know. I mean, we are pretty fearful after all. But yeah, we're just out here enjoying the uh, the day. Smelling the beautiful blooming flowers. Uh, I was attacked by nature. Yeah, exactly. I was attacked by nature in a little spot there. It looked like it was snowing. I actually had a flower in my hair for a while. I think it's gone now, but I'm not going to San Francisco, so I can't wear flowers in my hair. What is San Francisco? It's just all. <laughs> San Francisco treat. Uh, ding, ding. Yeah, I'm crossing the streams now. I probably ought not do that. But yeah, we're just gonna walk around for a little bit. We're gonna probably hit up a few places. Might stop off by the Asian market, got some stuff to pick up. Maybe Johnny Brock's to look at some costume stuff. But yeah. Because why not? Yeah, why not? Who knows where the day may take us. This is this is a fun little day for the Turks to be out and about and just enjoying weather. It's, it's a day off. It is. It's our day off and everything's changing. We're going from the harsh coldness of winter to the wonderfully floral springtime. My allergies are gonna be killing me by tonight, but whatever. But yeah, we're just gonna walk around and enjoy things. It's it's just, it's beautiful. This, this is too perfect of a day to pass up. You just can't let it happen. So let's see what the rest of this day has in store for us, huh? All right, we've been traveling along, and this this has been bothering me for a long time. Rude, you got a smudge on your glasses, and it's like driving me nuts. Useless. Aha. It's useless. 
They don't make them like they used to. Ah, ah there you go. <laughs> Problem solved. Once again, guys, my partner, Rude. Update, we have now upgraded our Turks Tea Party to Boba Tea Party. Yeah, look at that, isn't that good? I got toasted brown sugar cheese foam with boba. Mm. See that five times fast? I know, right? Man, that's good. I'm gonna have a sugar-induced coma after this, but this is awesome stuff. All right, so on that sad note, the Turks have to call their day off an end, but before all the shenanigans decide to end, Rude decided to invite me over for a spot of dinner. Turns out, he's a pretty great cook. Go figure. But I hope you guys enjoyed our little adventure today. I know Rude, Elena, and myself had a wonderful time. And I have to give credit where credit is due. Much as a tea party didn't seem like it would be my thing, I dug it. I mean, the food was great. The sweets were... That little swan cream puff, I'm gonna need a, the recipe for that because that needs to be mine right now. That was amazing. But that's all we've got, so thanks for sticking around, guys, and uh, behave yourselves. We'll see ya.